Hello guys, welcome to Tech Tips. Today I will show you how to install Eclipse completely offline. I have provided link to download some of the steps. So please download before before proceeding. So let's get started. So first thing is you need to install Java for Eclipse. So install Java. Click next. Next. Click next and wait a while until it uh, completes the installation. Now click close. So for uh, uh, so now the installation of Java is completed. Uh, now we need to install this um, environmental variables so we are dealing with eclipse android so for that you need to install this Oops. this java runtime environment double click this click yes and proceed with the steps click install and set everything default once the installation is completed click close open up my computer go to C drive program files java jre7 bin and copy this directory open up my computer go to properties and now go to advanced advanced system settings environmental variables and go to path click edit and right now make a semicolon and paste the directory click ok 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 close everything and now um, so once you have downloaded the file uh, uh, from the download uh, link I have provided in the description, you will get an uh, zip file. You need to extract extract that uh, to the desktop. And once the extraction is completed, you will find these two folders. So this folder uh, is the SDK manager and the AVD manager, and this is the Eclipse. Here is Eclipse, and right now, open this Eclipse. while so now set the workspace to as it is click ok file new android application project now enter a name anything you wish npc click next 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 blank activity and click finish So that's it. So we got this. Now we need to set our AVD to check this program or to run this program. Now 
go to window and draw virtual device manager click on that and now click new name anything you need wish now the avd name is xpc and the device is anything uh, for the power drive is 4.2.2 and set the ram to minimum 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 and click stop ok uh, check this will display to real size and then click launch so here the AVD is uh, launching for the first time so it takes a bit of time so please be wa waited for this so now we got the emulator booted up and it is working properly so now close everything out and now uh, go to this source folder and move on this one and double tap this main activity that java now run this program I click on this arrow I check this Android application click OK and now let's check this emulator perfect now we got that application ABC running in our emulator properly so we have uh, successfully done this one and in case if you need to uh, download a or develop an application for a higher version of Android uh, go to the Android SDK manager and download the version you need uh, and right now I have uh, this one only for the ice cream sandwich and you can uh, download anything you wish and then uh, if you place this uh, extracted folder anywhere else on your computer you need to configure them using uh, android sdk now go to the android preferences go to preferences and go to android and set this sdk location to the place where you have placed them and by default i have set them on the desktop so i have uh, here i set this as the desktop so that's it thank you for watching so before that um I would recommend you to watch my next video, install Android Studio completely offline. So thank you for watching, see you guys in my next video.